feel like I've arrived. A couple of days ago, I got this little note from YouTube. Hi, St. Nick's. They sound so pleasant. Due to a copyright takedown notice that we received, we had to take down your video from YouTube. It was my most recent one, Why They Hate Porn Part 2. And uh, the takedown was issued by the bold and the beautiful people. <laughs> now, I originally recorded it um, straight from the TV and YouTube blocked it. I was like, okay. So what I did was I um, made a video of the video and posted it and it went through. And it sat for about a week and a fucking half before I guess somebody caught it and then either went running to YouTube or went running to the CBS folks and they had it taken down. Let's see, you received a copyright strike. You now have one copyright strike. If you get multiple copyright strikes, we'll have to disable your account. To prevent that from happening, please don't upload videos containing copyrighted content that you aren't allowed to use. You know. <laughs> and there is no censorship of the internet. Don't forget that. Okay? Don't forget that. You know, internet, you can express your views. You know, it's funny, the nice little way around shit like freedom of speech and freedom of expression is copyrights, um, creative license. And I did put fair use. If you remember the video, like fair use, MF, fair use. So I acknowledged it wasn't mine, but still, nevertheless. What to do next? If you believe you're not at fault in one or more of the instances above, you can appeal this takedown by submitting a counter notification. Keep in mind that there may be severe legal consequences for submitting a counter notification with false information. Let me get let me straighten out something for you folks. When you see the word may, that's bullshit. May means will. You know, if uh, say like with uh, your bank account, if you are overdrawn on your account, you may be subject to a fee. No, you will be subject. See, that's just a nice little way of saying you will get fucked up, but they say it in a pleasant way. You can also contact the party that removed your video and ask them to retract their takedown. Yeah, I'm going to ask uh, the bold and the beautiful folks to retract the takedown of that snippet that I was showing with two old ass women throwing cake at each other, making complete fools of themselves. Yeah, fat chance that's gonna happen. But it's a good day for me. Like I said, I feel like I've arrived. And now I know what my MGTO and Ibmore and SYSBN brothers are going through. Tommy is going through. Maybe BGS, Ibmore, maybe I'm Aaron. What all they've gone through when they've gotten that dreaded copyright strike. Ooh, I'm so scared. But I'll be more mindful because I don't need the great mother of YouTube putting the hammer down on me. And it's funny. <clears throat> the head of YouTube is a woman. And it seems women love to believe that they're more empathetic and sympathetic to things. When, But it's odd when you put them in positions of authority. Not all, but many of them. They seem to be even more draconian, especially if the person on the receiving end of it is a man. Margaret Thatcher, anyone? Indira Gandhi, anyone? Golda Meir, anyone? Look those names up. You can use the internet to see asses twerking. You can look up those names I mentioned. Use it for something productive for a damn change. Anyway, that's my vid. Migto, Ibmore, SYSBM. Comment, rate, subscribe. I am out.